Greetings, Zero here, and welcome back to the Liquid Crystal Fairy Sumon type run. Last time, I got the first Orange Island badge and witnessed Mr. OC Donut Steel continuing his trend of following bad fanfiction cliches. At this point, I have to wonder if it's a deliberate parody of that sort of OC, but that might be giving Link and Zelda too much credit. So, uh, yeah, this time, we're going to be starting things off at the Cave of Wisdom, which is south uh, southwest of uh, Leaf Bay. Oh, damn. Okay, you know what? This is annoying. What was that? Okay, here it is, down here. Okay, so basically this is a kind of a gauntlet challenge. Talk to this guy. Yeah, basically, um, you have to beat a bunch of wild Pokemon. And I say wild, but you can't actually catch them, so not really. It's more like trainer battles. And these Pokemon can range from being in the, I think, the high 50s to the low 80s. And these can include legendary and mythical Pokemon. Some of them, this is the only way to legitimately encounter them in the Crystal. Like Mewtwo, for example. But what do we got the first time? Milotic, level 63. Okay. Nope. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't catch this one. Nope. Beldum, okay. That's first floor done. Trio. No pass. And, Bo, you can come back here as many times as you want, so you could, if you really want to, use this place to farm for experience. So if you're going to do that, I would recommend saving before it, you fight a given statue, so that way you maximize the chance of getting something like a legendary Pokémon, which is going to give you more experience. Especially if it's a higher level. Yeah, I'm going to train up uh, Galad here while I can. Fuck off. Okay, seriously, knock it off. Wait, I don't need to use Max Repels in here. What am I doing? Yeah, we've already got we taken care of all of them on this floor. Curlia. Ogre, okay. Really? You're just gonna pull a fuck ton of crits out of your ass.
Yeah, it's weird. It seems like it seems like Hydro Pump is critting the first time it's been used every time in this episode. Am I right? Weird. No, fuck off, Mill Tank. Oh, you're gonna heal me anyway. Fine. Then I'm off. Really? Go down already, you piece of shit. Actually, I got, I got others. I can just spend those. Wait, where did I put those? Yeah, oh, here, right. And, yeah, the lower sections are dark, so you're gonna need flash it. Or, well, actually, you don't need it, but it makes it a lot easier to navigate, obviously. Okay, okay, there we go, that's done. Okay. Well, that that problem solved itself, I guess. I wish it didn't make me waste a power point on it, though. I'm not gonna waste a max repel down here. Dad. Didn't register the input, I was trying to tell it to go left, but no. Okay, now we got this one. Done sparse. Level 88. Now this is the last level. There's seven opponents. I think there's seven of them down here. Oh! Hi, Raiko! Yeah, we're not taking chances with that. Level 81, Raiko. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right. Nice try. Oh, you tank that. Well done. And the last opponent is Magnavox. And now we just pick up one of these. Like I said, we can come back here anytime we want. So, uh... Leave, and without further ado, let's go back and install that little crystal we found. So we're just going to put this in here, and well, as you can see, we are in Goldenrod City. Isn't technology amazing? So back in, in Leaf Bay, well, we can't go east yet, so... Because there's stuff we gotta do over here. The Nexus is up to no good, you see. 
So let's go north. Actually, hang on. Grab this, and now... You're really not cut out for this line of work, are you? Find this mansion. And down here, it's a Team Nexus base. Yeah, I'm sure it's important. Unfortunately, I'm more important. Just fuck off, Tauros! Yeah, they really like their Tauros in Team Nexus, and they are very, very tanky. What's really annoying is that everyone seems to have a Tauros set up with a stall move set. Instead of, you know, offense. Fuck you, Haunter. And shit like that with Destiny, Bond, and Grudge. It's just there to waste your time, really. I mean, it's not gonna- it's not gonna stop me. I've got a full team. Well, not really. I've all got four of my team with me, but... It's not gonna stop me. And protect! Wasting my time! Again! Just... fuck off. Anything over here? Nope. Okay. Anything over here? Oh. Yeah, by the way, you want to get every item you can down in this basement because you cannot come back here after you're done. No, fuck off. Nope. Yeah, we'll find out what that thing is rather soon. What? How did he outrun me? That's some bullshit right there! Last I checked, Destiny Bond is not a priority move. What kind of bullshit was that? Hunter's not that fast! Certainly not with a 20 level difference between us! <sighs> then again, as we've established in prior episodes, this game has no qualms with cheating just to fuck you over. There have been Pokemon in this hack with illegitimate movesets last I checked. Or. Wait, no, I'm thinking. I'm thinking of Canto Complete, never mind. Canto Complete, that had some blatantly. Bullshit movesets. In this one, I think there might be a couple that have illegitimate movesets, but uh, I can't remember which ones they are. Yeah, well, you shouldn't either. Don't you know this place is condemned? Oh yeah, uh... Yeah, if we, went, if we went to the left, that would be the point where we'd be forced out of here. Fuck off already, Hariyama. Fuck off.
Yeah, just more Pokemon with boost sets designed specifically to waste your time. Oh yeah, because Ancient Power is arbitrarily a contact move. That was never especially consistent, especially not in Gen 3. With abilities like Static or Flame Body. And that's the last battle in the basement down here. There's no hidden items. Last I checked. That's why he's calling himself now Mr. Z. I'm sorry, but there could be only one Mr. Z here, and it's me. Yep, that was the self-destruct going off. So, uh, back to Pokemon. Now that that's done, we can finally go to the east. And this takes us to what's called the Surf Gates. This will take us to the next island. First, let's put on a Max Repel. Yeah, if you're wondering why I'm not putting certain items away, it's because I basically hit the limit of what the PC can store. Because while your bag's capacity is expanded, the PC's is not. Always fucking raining. Just fuck off already. Okay, so that's done. Ready. Fine, be that way. Shouldn't have wasted my time, bitch. Again, the rules of this game are very simple. I win, you lose. Simple as that. I'm just going to fight all the trainers here, because again, trying to get as much money and experience as I can. Oh. Probably pretty picked up an item. Bolivia? Uh, Bolivia is a country in South America. I'm not sure if that place really exists in this universe, but... Actually, then again, Guiana exists. That's where they found Mew, although that got retconned, apparently. Okay... Okay, yeah, we're almost there now. Did you see that? That little screen flicker? That's gonna be important. We'll find out in the next episode what why that is. We're gonna heal real quick and... Yeah, Team Nexus is here. So, uh, next episode we're gonna find out what they're up to. Um, if you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, check out the Rumble page, and I will catch you all next time.